Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to share this video with you today. A few weeks ago, the company Brandless reached out to me to see if they could send me a box of beauty products and tools for my review. They just expanded their line of beauty products and they have all kinds of different awesome things and everything is formulated without 400 identified chemicals and ingredients that aren't super great for you. So they've removed 400 of those from all of their products, which I think is awesome. They're also 100% cruelty free, which is also very awesome. And so they have all these different cool new products and they shipped me a box to share with you. It's funny, I've been following Brandless on Instagram for quite a while now, probably a year or more. And there have been several times where I've gone to their website and added things to my cart, but never checked out. And so I'm so excited to share this video of my thoughts about their new beauty products and just about the company in general. So let's just jump right in. So the company sent me this big old box of a bunch of their new beauty products from their new line and I tried them out and wanted to share with you my thoughts on them and just share the products with you. I have to say that truly I'm so blown away that all of these products are $3 and I'm also really blown away that Brainless has gone to the extent that they've created a, four, I think it's like 400 banned ingredients that they don't use in any of their things like parabens and sulfates and that word that starts with a P that I can't pronounce. And they, so they don't have any of that junk in their stuff, which I think is really cool because a lot of other companies do have that kind of stuff in their stuff. So anyway, I really, I really appreciate that. I like that. You guys know that I like the more natural things. So I'm just going to show you each of these products and talk to you about them a little bit and what my thoughts are on them now that I've had the chance to try them and see what I think. So the first thing is this grapefruit facial scrub and it is just like what you would imagine. It's just has a, a gritty facial scrub. I love using facial scrubs like once or twice a week. I think my makeup is more smooth when I do. I really like this because it smells definitely like grapefruit, but it's a light scent. You don't feel like you're rubbing an entire grapefruit on your face. It has a very light scent. I like the texture of it. The grit of this product is exactly what I was imagining. It's not too light of a grit or too heavy of a grit. It's like a perfect medium grit face wash. So I really enjoyed using this. I would definitely buy this for $3 over spending like double or triple that on a facial scrub from the drugstore um, because it works just as well and it smells really, really nice and I really liked using it and then putting on makeup because it just sloughs off the dead skin. I really liked it. The next thing I tried is this green apple facial toner. So fun fact, I absolutely adore, like in my top three scents of all time is anything that's scented green apple or like Macintosh red apple. I just love that apple smell. I have always loved it. It smells so good. So immediately the first thing I did when I got this was pop it open and smell it. Oh, it smells so, this is perfect for summer. It's really, really refreshing. It's um, made with witch hazel, which I have used witch hazel on my face as a toner for a long time. I really like using witch hazel. So I love that that's in here. And it just smells really nice. It feels really good. I loved the way it worked. Highly recommend. Next up is this facial lotion. This is made with aloe and it is fragrance free. So it is just like a bare bones, light facial lotion. It won't clog your pores. It doesn't have any weird junk in it. And so I really liked using this. It's very stripped down. It's just the most basic facial lotion. So I was thinking like in the summertime, it would be really great to use this because like it's just so easy. Um, the men in your life, like if you have a husband or boyfriend, he would probably love using this because it doesn't smell like anything. It's not like some thick feeling. It's just the most, just imagine the most basic, basic facial lotion that has, like I said, fragrance free, so a little bit of aloe in it. Um, and so I liked it. I think, like I said, like Riley, my husband would love this because it's, he always is, he's like, I don't want to use all your stuff. It's just too weird. This is like the most basic facial lotion. I really liked it though. Like I put it on and then I tried it using it with makeup and things and I, I like using it. I really do like it. Um, but I think this would be also perfect for, or like a preteen or someone who's like just getting into washing their face, something like that. This, use this. Next up is this night cream. This is one of my favorite things that I received. It smells like lavender because it has lavender oil in it and also has kind of just like an herby, oh, it's just, it smells amazing. It's very calming. I love the consistency of it because it doesn't feel like you're like plastering your face. You know, some night creams are so heavy. It's not like that, it's not so heavy, but it's definitely very heavily moisturizing and you wake up and your skin doesn't feel tight, your skin feels nice and 
soft and moisturized and I love this especially since we're in the summer right now I live in Texas it's so hot my skin is just sucked of moisture and so this I really really liked really liked would definitely purchase on my own um, and like I said I'm like such a sucker for anything that smells like essential oils Mm, it has such a calming, I don't even know how to describe it. I mean, it smells like lavender, but it's it's mixed with, it looks like it has sage extract in it as well. And so it's just this nice, like herbal calming scent. Um, and it works really well too. So I really enjoyed the night cream. The next two products I'm gonna show are also my favorites. So my favorites were the night cream and next up this one and then the third, third one I'm going to show you next. Those are my three favorites of the box that I received. So this is the body lotion and it has aloe in it and the scent is green tea and aloe. This smells so good. I cannot even tell you. I've been putting it on my arms. It has that fresh herbal, it's green tea and aloe, but I, I mean, I don't know if there's any other oils in it or what. It just smells amazing. This stuff smells amazing. It is like a joy to put on your skin and walk around and you just smell it. Mm. I really like the way it feels. It is moisturizing, but it's lightweight. I hate when you can feel lotion on your skin and you cannot feel lotion on your skin with this. So I would absolutely buy this again. I, de I definitely want to place a brands list order with some of the food items as well. Um, but I will be using this this summer and I will definitely think about repurchasing or see if they have another scent because I would because they apparently are really good with scents because this smells amazing. I love this. So my third favorite thing that's tied with the night cream and the body lotion is the foot cream. I guess I'm all about creams right now. And this is mint scented. It has coconut oil in it. Um, it also has rosemary extract. So it has, again, I just love that herbally. Mm, it smells so good. It feels really good on your feet. It's like very refreshing after a long day. And I found my feet to be a lot more dry this summer than they have in years past. So I've been putting just regular body lotion on my feet, but I started using this and I like it so much more because it's thicker and it's formulated for your feet. Plus it has that like minty rosemary smell. It's really, really nice. I really like this. I like the consistency of it a lot and it works. It really does work. I really like it. One thing I really like about these products is that they don't have any dye in them. They're all just white. Like they're all just the color of the ingredients when they put them together. Also on the labels they each say that they are gluten free so if you're gluten intolerant then i i've never thought about that because i myself am not but i'm sure that would be really frustrating if you find a beauty product you like that has gluten in it so these are gluten free which i think is really neat as well i was also thinking that these would be so fun for like an off to college basket if you have someone in your life who's heading off to college this fall just putting some fun you know foot creams and facial scrubs and things in a little basket with like a new towel or you know that kind of thing would be a really cute gift also if someone was getting engaged you could give them some little pampering things i was thinking these would be perfect for my husband for his stocking this christmas he would love this kind of stuff he would love having a few different things and it wouldn't break the bank because they're all three dollars um, which i think is really really cool so just i think gifts like gift giving i mean this stuff is great for yourself but i think for gifts it would be fun because i always want like putting together baskets but it's they're deceivingly expensive, you know, putting together a gift, a gift basket. Um, but this stuff is $3 each, so I feel like you could get a lot for a good price. Okay, moving on to some of the beauty items that aren't as much of products. I also received these Emery Board nail files, which I love having a fresh nail file when I'm doing my nails. Some people have like the same one for 15 years and it like barely works anymore. This The sandpaper is like completely worn off. So it's always nice to have some new ones and it comes with three standard sized nail files and one travel size nail file. Next up are these cuticle nippers. I love using these. I love using these. Another fun thing if someone had just gotten engaged and they got a ring would be to do like a little manicure kit and do like some kind of hand cream or body lotion and the cuticle and the emery boards. That would be a really good gift idea as well. But anyway, these are great. They're stainless steel. They're in this nice little package. Really cute. Love them. Next up are these slant tweezers. So they're tweezers that have, you know, that slant at the end so that they're good for doing your eyebrows or whatever else. They come in a nice little pouch, which I love for travel. The tweezers that I have now don't, didn't come in a pouch. And so I'll totally, these will be my travel tweezers. It's always nice to have some with you. Um, but again, they're stainless steel. They look like they're super well-made and um, I like that they come in a pouch. I just love this packaging. I'm such a junkie for packaging. I think this would be, because it doesn't distract from the product. So if you were gifting it to someone, one, or even if just on your own like it's just nice to not have all the distractions I guess that's why they call it brandless next up still in the nail care category is this nail clipper set with the two different nail clippers one that's a little 
fingernail clipper and one that's a toenail clipper. Um, they have like nice little grippy handles, really great. And lastly is this dual sharpener, which is for large and small pencils, which I am obsessed with because the one that I have only has one set. It only has one size. And so you, there are like a couple of pencils that I have that are really, really hard to sharpen because they don't fit into my sharpener. So this is super smart that it has a smaller side and a larger side. Love that. So that was everything in the box from Brandless that I received. Huge thanks to Brandless. I really enjoyed reviewing your products and testing them out. Definitely recommend them. Like I said, my favorites were the night cream, the body lotion, and the foot cream if you're looking for somewhere to start. If you have tried Brandless before, I would love if you would leave me a comment below and let me know which products you have tried because like I said, I'm definitely eager to buy a box that includes some of their other beauty products and also some of their food items because I've definitely seen quite a few friends on Instagram post about their brandless orders and people love it. Like people just really love, I know that their coffee is really popular and a few other things. So I would love to try it out for myself. I will leave a link to all of the items that I mentioned today below if you want to go check it out and also just a link to Brandless in general if you want to go check out their website. There are all kinds of fun things for you to go and shop and check out. If you try any of their beauty products, I would love to hear from you and see what you think if you've tried them in the past or if you go ahead and purchase any of the ones that I mentioned today. Another huge thanks to Brandless for working with me on this video. If you enjoyed it, I would really appreciate a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content. I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.